Hi everybody! In this video we uh, give an uh, explanation of the next symbol, the flower of completion. Two years ago, no, five years ago, I received this symbol during my master attunement in Shambhala H. MH MDH Shambhala yes. MDH Shambhala Multidimensional Healing Attunement. Yes. Yeah. And there was a short explanation. And you, during the last uh, three years, I received many, many information. A great deal of information about this. Yeah. It was about two years later, if I'm not mistaken, after your attunements that you really started to get the beginnings of what this symbol means and the energies that it contains and my goodness uh, whoa but I remember as well I remember you getting this symbol just after the attunement or sharing with mm -hmm. me that you got this symbol and that you were extremely impressed by it you yes. said you, you, you were kind of blown away if I remember yes, right it's very powerful <laughs> yeah and as you started to explain to me um, what it looked like mm. um, it was certainly difficult in the beginning to sort of give a description of it, uh, but you started off by describing there are there are thirty six infinity symbols. Yeah. Ooh, wow. <laughs> yeah. And just so that you know what we're talking about, we've already put an image right on the beginning of the video, so you can see it straight away. And if you need to, you can rewind it. You go back to it. You have another look at it. But these 36 infinity symbols, there's much more to them than we originally thought. Because as time passed, you started to receive information of how, well, we know the infinity symbol, it's the magnetic, electric. electric yes. And in the central point, it comes into balance, into expansion. But it's also duality. These are 72 aspects of duality. We have to take in balance. Mm -hmm. So there are 36 infinity symbols with 72 sections, parts. I mean, the one yes. half and the other half, that multiplies by two. So there are 72. And somehow or other, and our brains, our logic, doesn't understand no. it really. But we, it was shared. The 72 wants all of these aspects of our duality throughout the 36. Yes. The 72, it came into balance, was brought into balance, and it became 144. Yes. Yet more magical, um, numerological numbers. It's a 9. Mm -hmm. And it's also 9. Completion. Completion. That was the reason. 36 is numerologically. Nine and nine is completion, and the flower of completion means to uh, step from duality mm -hmm. to oneness with this symbol. Completing all patterns, all yes. programs, releasing them, and stepping out, as you just said, in, from duality into triality. And having worked with those energies and having reached that point of the 144, something really magical happened, if I remember rightly, because I'm having a vision all of a sudden of this beautiful green energy. Yes, the emerald. Yeah. And the emerald is connecting with uh, Lord, 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 Lord Raphael. Yes. Yeah. Um, and green is the color of the heart chakra. And the meaning of the flower of completion is to transform uh, 72 aspects of a duality in your heart. It makes 144 aspects. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because this is the triality of every aspect infinity of our, symbol. Every aspect of our being. And it's not really important to know what those aspects are or it's not really important to know what it is you're transforming. The simple fact of the matter is that you simply trust that it is taking place. And if you're doing it with your eyes closed or you're working with it with your eyes closed, sometimes it'll even show you what it's working on. 
it will show you because it's an important point, if you will, of your journey that will help you to understand where you're at, where, what you're working on and where you're going to, if you will. The goal that you wish to achieve or maybe something that you'd like to give attention to, to help you to ascend. The most beautiful thing about all of this, Lord Raphael is always there, is always in that beautiful green energy. And he's there to assist, to transform, and you only need to call upon him. And he'll be there, he'll help you. And whether you're conscious of it or not, is not really important. Just know and trust, he is there with his beautiful assistance to help you through your processes. A very, very beautiful, powerful symbol. Yes. But we have to give you a little bit of a warning too. Because if I remember rightly, you had one made. Yes. And you started to wear it. Yes. <laughs> and what happened to you? Oh. oh. <laughs> Mario in the beginning was only able to wear it for a few hours, if yes. I'm not mistaken. And she had to take it off again and put it aside and, and just give it a little bit of time and be patient. Yeah. And, and then, of course, when she felt she could again, she put it on again. Now, it was pretty expensive to make it. Yes, very expensive. So we're not expecting you all to go out there and have one of these made. No. We made it easy for you. Because in the materials or on the sites, you can actually save that image, print it out, yes. and if possible, have it plastified, and you can carry it, you can wear it um, close to your heart if you have a pocket. In the center, uh, yeah. And it'll do its work. The simple fact of the matter that you've got it close to your heart, it'll work for you. And, but if you don't want to do that, well, you can do it. I mean, we really are this powerful these days that all you need to do is close your eyes, visualize that beautiful flower of completion, and visualize yourself putting it into your heart. Yes. And then realizing and maybe seeing that it is there, and it'll start to do its work. It'll start to weave its magic. It brings you in totally balance. Totally in balance. Yes. Wow, that's like, I mean, that feels good. <laughs> yes. There's a little bit of Dutch there, but that yeah. feels good. Well, folks, we hope, trust, that you've enjoyed this little bit of an explanation of the flower completion. We certainly know that you are going to feel it when you follow these instructions. Enjoy, enjoy, and maybe just a little another another little note to add to it. Remember, if you do go through aspects of your being that are being transformed that might not seem pleasant at the time, always, always remember that it is for your greatest good that these are being shown to you, so that you can learn to see through the illusion of duality to choose to step into triality. So know that the rewards at the end of it all are always, always, always going to be beautiful. Like a flower. Like a flower. <laughs> like yes. the symbol itself. Yes. Well said. <laughs> well, uh, yeah, that was a good one. Mm. Was it? I think uh, we've shared enough about the flower of completion, so well, everybody, thank you. Thank you yet again for listening to an explanation of one of the symbols, a very, very powerful symbol.